check check these prices out. I'm gonna have Mountain Dew, but I'm not gonna pay four dollars for a Mountain Dew. We just saw prices in by the pool. You can come out here for two fifty. Here's some two dollar ones. Oh, almost got some chips falling. I'd rock this machine, but I'm not a twenty year old anymore. I love it. I love it having my second cup here in my luxury hotel room here. <laughs> I don't know what this room cost. Let me see. It was the cheapest one or one of the uh, the two cheapest ones I could find on on Expedia when I booked. Again, the reason I booked a hotel is because I got here at midnight. So my sister wasn't going to be able to pick me up and friends had to work today. So I said, I'll just get a hotel five minutes from the from the airport, which I've already had my my breakfast this morning, my free breakfast. That was nice. Had some uh, an omelet and some sausage. Could have made a waffle, but I was too lazy. Some orange juice, some kind of strudel shit in Shanghai thing. I don't know, it was good. It was good, nice little selection there. I just had to switch batteries on this GoPro. My old batteries are swollen. I bought two new batteries here this last year, but the two that I had from previous, they get hot and they get swollen, so they barely even fit in the camera. Well, the issue with these older batteries is this one was at 88% and it cut off the camera there and said that um, it were out of battery. 88% of the battery was life left. And it said, sorry, we unexpected whatever because you ran out of battery. What? I think the thing's finally getting sick. So we'll see how this new battery holds up. I'm gonna take you on a quick tour of this hotel. When I was a kid, my parents used to bring us to a pool like this. <clears throat> Holiday Inns. My dad, stepmother, and I got divorced. My parents got divorced so young, so it wasn't my mother. It was my stepmother, my father, and us kids, and and their friends. Boy, I can, my eyes are already burning in here because of the chlorine. But to us at age 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, whatever it was, this was the life, man. You could sit and play in the pool all day. We'd always get these adjoining hotel rooms so the parents could party all night, all day long. Kids could swim all day long. This is pretty cool. We didn't have anything like this though. The old dumping buckets of mayhem here and the half Viking ship. And then there was usually a sauna somewhere around here. Times were a little bit better though. You could actually hoot and holler and run around and scream. They didn't want you running. In fact, one time I remember wiping out on the concrete hard deck around the pool one day. I smacked my, my head so hard. Boy, I thought I knocked myself out. I didn't cry. I didn't want to be a little baby. But boy, I remember seeing stars for a second. <clears throat> Everybody laughing at me. You had to have a hotel with a pool. Because in Minnesota, you had to have a roof. Because it snows here, so you have to have a roof. I about lost my shit last night when I came looking at prices here. $2 for a Reese's. $2, $2, $2, $2, everything's $2. If that's the prices of everything here in the States, well, who the hell can afford to have anything? You gotta make a million bucks just to afford to have a little snack. We just saw prices in by the pool. You can come out here for 250. Here's some $2 ones.
Speed test. I need 30, 40 to upload within uh, an hour probably. Look at the speed uploads here. What? Terrible. Of course you gotta run an ad before you show the numbers. Ten download seven point five six upload. Yeah, no, not not very good. Not very good. Not gonna work to upload. I gotta find a place today to upload. I do have a video ready for you guys. Again, Monday morning, 9:38. Yes. Well, you know me. I gotta vlog a little bit of this. Oh. <laughs> yeah. This is my sister Heidi, everyone. Hello. And my mother over here. Hey. And my niece Sarah. How are you? Hello. She's sick. Sarah's not sick. Oh, that's no good. Well, she's, she's been home since Thursday. Oh. Oh, I'm sorry, boys. that a camera? It's a camera. Do it. <laughs> this is a nice ride. This is. When did you get this thing? Um, Look at this, everybody. Um, March, maybe? Okay. Long story. Wow. <laughs> Fun. Picking up prescriptions. Drive through window here, people. Pretty simple. Um, What's your prescription for? Blood pressure. Uh, everybody's got high blood pressure need a over new here. One, new what? Uh, another prescription? Coming out? No, not, no, not yet. What's an RSV vaccine? Is that like a new vaccine everybody has to get here? I'm not getting it. Yeah. But. Well, they want you to. I don't, it's got. More of this COVID junk? It's the respiratory. Yeah. Oh, it's man. mainly for kids. Are they doing it for adults now, too? Yeah, here it goes. Everything is quick here. Even this drive through for her prescription will take only four or five minutes. Sign here, pay this, goodbye. Whereas in the Philippines, it's a lot longer process sometimes. What do you got going on over there? Are you singing, dancing? She's in her own world. Okay. <laughs> 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 Sarah, you like videos. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Um, I thought I did my internet for you. You could be on your camera. I don't think you did because literally... Well, actually, I did, so look. Mm, oh. Got your own it's tablet cooking here? Yeah, uh, bah! Wow. Here, put my phone Got a away. hot spot in here in this car, Apple CarPlay. I do. You got gray hair, Heidi. I know, I love it. I'm growing, I'm growing it out. <laughs> hey, Heidi's two look years very older similar. than me. They both look pretty similar. I'm, I'm yeah, don't pretty, they? I have had gray hair. You, you look good. They look old, don't they? I have had gray hair. That's what I know to say. Well, we are old. Yeah, we are now, old. Now, that's pretty obvious, Grandma. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> But I've had gray hair since I was 35. Yeah, oh, really? I haven't had hair since I've been yeah, right, 35. Right. Yeah, you literally <laughs> bald. Literally. Yeah. Speaking of bald, what does that look bald. like? I I just shave it so I don't look Mom, old. Mom, er. I remember one time we went to this kind of restaurant and, 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 and there was that kind of guy there. that looked I, just like him. Yeah. 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 There's a lot of old guys that look like me. <laughs> no kidding. Yeah. Literally, no kidding. Yeah. Oh, and it look, guess who else would agree? Fox, eh? Nissan Pathfinder. Yeah, why is it black? I think it's black. Oh, you can do a special black plate now? It's just like getting Viking plates. Yeah, I had the, the Loon habit, Critical Habitat. You pay so much extra for some of these yeah, license Alan, plates. 60 bucks a year? Alan yeah. Now it looks good with the car and all. It's the top of the line, you know. So usually you get like blue and white, but you can up a plate. And then I did the personalized chubs, but you can't do chubs on a special plate like this. I mean, you might be able to, but then you're paying a lot extra every year. When did you move in here? A month ago? Two months ago? Uh, no, a week or four, month, four weeks ago. Four weeks ago. She had a apartment condo in uh, Plymouth area here in Minnesota just on the outskirts of Minneapolis 
So you got your cane cooking now, huh? I, I usually walk, use a walker. I'm a lot more feeble than I used to be. She fell at one point and didn't, wasn't able to get up off the ground or off the floor of the bathroom for what, a day, a night? Uh, six hours. Six hey. hours, okay. No, are, am I just gonna throw that in mom's car? Wow. On the way out of here or something? Sure. We'll just leave it in there for now. Wow. Wow, okay. you're getting tall. I'm How one, old? One, one, one. Eleven? Eleven? Oh my gosh. Yes. Oh my gosh, you're getting big. I can still hear the song about, what was it called? Oh yeah, Mandy. Metallica? Musical, Enter song. Sandman? Um, does man, somebody want you got, to What do you got? You got a lot going on, don't you? I, I mean. Which is a real mess. So how many bedroom is this? Two. Two, okay. So you're still in a two bedroom. Yeah, but they're much smaller. So this is assisted living? No, this one is, it's, well, it's both a, uh, if need be, you just hit, assisted, but just hit a button or something? Okay. Well, they, they want you to wear pendants, so if you fall down. Uh, okay. But I'm not on that plan yet, so. Well, it's kind of nice. You're in your own apartment, at least. Yes. Yeah. She went from one apartment to the other, and I always told her she kind of hangs on to too much stuff. <laughs> As, as you can see, but, it's like a hoarder. A hoarder. We went through four loads in my vehicle to get rid of. Oh. Beforehand. Yeah, and this is this is this is what's left. Like Where's my tote? Room. I have a tote, don't I? Somewhere. Yeah, yes, right, right there. there. Okay, that's it. This is me, guys. This is all yeah. I have. This is it. Now you gotta go through that now, cause I don't have room for that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Holy moly! Well, this isn't bad. And then there's another room of stuff. That's, uh, that's the bedroom. Okay. So this is how mom lives, everybody. Well. This is how mom lives. That's a big bathroom. Yeah, this is pretty spacious in here. Mom, here's the pants. Walk-in closet. All right. I'm so glad I don't have clutter. It was, uh, it was uh, so refreshing to unload everything. And I didn't have this much ever, but... Mom's always kind of held on to memorabilia, photo albums, and all that good stuff like people should do now and then for a while until they say, okay, I don't want to live like this anymore. Perkins, an everybody favorite, right? Ooh, what did it say? Strawberries. It said season one. It said Perkins is where we stopped at because it's an everybody favorite Coffee. here. In every Ooh. state, ooh, ooh, ooh. strawberry shortcake. Mm. Who doesn't like a taste of strawberry? Right. Don't <laughs> kind of remind us of somebody? Yes. Mm. Look, you guys, I just turned 55. So there's a special menu, or I get discounts. Is that what I get? For our guest 55 menu. all. It's smaller, a little bit smaller maybe. That's why I, I knew I was a senior citizen and when I yeah. turned this age, even though it's not really considered senior citizen. Yeah. Nice. Let's see what a burger costs just for shits and giggles. A burger, patty melt, $14.79. Classic cheeseburger, $12.89, everybody. $12.89. Three muffins. Oh no, I don't need that. Yeah, pretty much all right. Uh, over easy. Sarah, it's your turn. Um, cheese again. Such like plain cheese again. Um, with like you know, like no pickle, just like just real with the cheese. Um, and also make sure you don't like any. It's like just a plain cheeseburger. I don't think I understood a word she said there. What the hell was that? Yeah. <laughs> and that's right, yeah. That's the most important Because I love that's right. I have that problem too. If she picked that up, okay, good on her. The half it's sandwich, so the pot, ro I mel know. pot roast I milk, and the bowl of the potato soup. Mm. All right, that was Perkins. Good food, easy food. And this is the weather we got here, guys. It's like 50 degrees, isn't it? Look at her hide. Look at her hide. I'm out here in the rain, freezing. 
What a change from 100 to, to 50 degrees here. Rainy. This is early Minnesota spring weather. You can see the grass is starting to green up. It's gonna be 70 here in a couple days and I'll show you guys when it's nice. And it, it's this is one of the best parts of the year is this spring when things green up. Things, things are coming alive. See the trees aren't even budded yet. Six months a year here in Minnesota, it's snowy and shitty. Six months a year, it's pretty good. I borrowed my mother's 21 year old Toyota Matrix car. And I gotta remember certain things and I'm kind of trying to remind myself that you're not able to use phones here, cell phones. You have to abide by the driving regulations. Plus there's the slight risk of if this car breaks down, what am I going to do? My mother's always been a member of AAA, which is a service in case you break down, you call and you don't have to be the owner of the card. She pays the platinum rate, which means anybody using her vehicle is covered towing and whatever else, just in case. So that's very nice. And I thank you mother for letting me use your car while I am here. Gawker slow down, Gawker slow down, everybody slows down to check out accidents, I don't know what happened there, somebody spun out, hit something, sweeping up the road, of course we all slow down to check it out, that causes more accidents, it's called a Gawker slow down everybody, Gawker slow down, Uncle Adrian, check it out, there's our top golf here in Minnesota, I went there right before I moved here, top golf, what a cool place that is. Top golf. It's like a driving range where you aim for targets, everybody. I'll see if I can find a picture of it online for you guys. Top golf, really fun, entertaining. It's not the most inexpensive, but it's great for get togethers. Even people people who have never played golf before. It's fun to just hit some balls, aim for targets. They got lights out there. They got music. It's a good time. It really is a good time. Affinity Plus here. This is my federal credit union, everybody, where I keep some of my money. Very helpful service. I went in, they can instantly print out a new credit debit card for me. Which I thank Nate. That was very nice of you to just reconfirm my account. Uh, it is okay for me to live in the Philippines full time and maintain an account here in the States. Some banks don't allow that. I know Charles Schwab, people had warned me if they see suspicious activity in and always in the Philippines, they will shut you down. Well, I also have an account at Charles Schwab to keep me, keep my ATM fees to a minimum. They reimburse you for those fees. <coughs> um, I no longer need that or worry about that because now and then I will just do a chunk sum transfer from a bank here to my Philippines BPI account when say peso rates are high or I need a major purchase as long as you keep it under ten thousand uh, dollars they won't it's not a suspicious activity if you keep your BPI account less than ten thousand dollars you don't have to, re to report it to the IRS at tax time a few things that I've I've needed to or that I figured out and that I need to maintain just like this I just got my new cash debit um, and I checked my passwords and whatever's and made sure that my account knows that I am a permanent residence in Philippines for till further notice with them um, yes so as long as your banks know what and where and how things are working you will be fine. Some banks, like I said, will not allow you to be a permanent residence outside of the United States. They will shut your account down. Thank you very much.